Welcome to IBC 2024. Discover game-changing innovations, explore new business models, and network with over 170 countries right here in Amsterdam. Well, I'm with Brent from Switch.io now at the IBC in Amsterdam. And Brent, it's been an exciting four years since you founded the company. You're here at the IBC this year. How's it going? It's going great. This is our third time at this show. The market for this type of product has just exploded. Three years ago, people were saying you can't do it. Two years ago, they were saying we want to do it. And now we're actually doing it. And what are you doing for those who don't <laughs> That's know? That's a good question. <laughs> uh, what we're doing is making it possible to do remote broadcast production in all of the major clouds. So we're talking about being able to do front end, high quality, lossless production in AWS, in Azure, in Google, in Oracle. And why did your business start in the first place? Uh, not in media, believe it or not. So our parent company is a US equities exchange. They wanted to move their market data distribution into Azure. Couldn't because multicast, which is a necessary protocol, didn't exist. We solved that problem. My background's all in media, high performance networking, and it was apparent from day one that the real market for this is in media. Media is multicast dependent. To be able to do it and distribute it in the cloud requires high performance, lossless multicast, and that's what we provide. Yeah, and your customers are obviously loving the solution that you provide, but uh, how do you keep ahead of the competition and, and the trends? <laughs> uh, it's all engineering and being able to work with customers, right? We've learned so much from being in production with the customers, seeing what their real needs are. And it's not just moving the packets and doing lossless, like I talked about. It's being able to do it in a way that allows them to run their production in a high availability, right? It's not just moving the packets, it's guaranteeing that they get there. It's giving them the visibility to know when things break, give them the tools they need to solve the problems and to keep things running. Uh, and we get that by working with them. So we have been in production with customers now for over a year. That knowledge is constantly feeding back into our product. And you're obviously having big conversations here and it's all mm -hmm. about that listening, isn't it? All about it, it is. tailoring yeah. that solution. It is, we've had, uh, this is only day two and it's been nonstop meetings with customers who are not just saying, okay, tell us why we need to do this. They're going, we want to do this, tell us how to do it. It's, we're already behind on this. We had it in our plans to do it. We're so happy to, to see that it's possible to do this. We've finally gotten buy-ins from the clouds themselves. They've realized this is possible and that it really increases their ability to provide these services for the customers. And then, you know, AI, which you can't get away from anywhere, has come up. So AI can do magical things with media but it can't do it if the media is not there. And where do you run AI? It's in the clouds. So you have to get the flows in the clouds and you have to do it in a way that's uncompromised. It's not compressed, it's actual high quality video. And do you see any other sectors, industries being able to benefit from this? Well, outside of media, obviously financial services, right? That's the core of who we started. We're working with all the major equities exchanges to, to do that. We also see it in healthcare and we see it in IoT. This protocol is, is spans the world. It's you know financial services to media to you know IoT. What about your growth journey then for the future? <laughs> uh, we're young. I mean the whole company is only four years, but we ramped up internally doing the exchange and now doing media. We see the next five years of growth being primarily driven by media, followed by financial services. Well, good luck for that growth, oh, and thank you. we'll see you next time. I'd love it. <laughs> Thanks, thank Brent. You. Okay, bye.